Now, I saw this video recently saying that Lamar Jackson can't throw. Now, the creator or the person who made this video, I won't say who this is, but you can see who the creator is in the title and description. In this video, I will explain why Jackson can throw, and if you don't, you are delusional or just simply a hater. Number one, now let's start with the obvious. Lamar Jackson is a two-time MVP. If Jackson couldn't throw, he would not be a two-time MVP. That's pretty obvious. He also has a great record, one of the best records in the league as a starter, beating a lot of great quarterbacks multiple times, such as Tom Brady, Joe Burrow multiple times. By the way, he's 5-1 and one versus Burrow. Josh Allen, Patrick Mahomes, Tua Tagovailoa, Patrick Mahomes, yes, he has beaten Patrick Mahomes before, and others. Jackson also has more touchdown passes and rushing than rushing scores and passing yards than rushing yards. If he couldn't pass, he would most likely have more rushing yards and rushing scores than passing. It's pretty simple. But for some reason, some are still ignorant towards the fact, or again, as I just mentioned, just a bunch of haters. Second, Jackson has led the league in touchdown passes. He was also close to throwing for 4,000 yards last season. He has also never been the top 10 for interceptions in a season. If again, he could not throw, it would be the opposite. It's amazing how some fans are so delusional. And again, I'll be saying that a lot today in this video. Delusional, delusional, delusional. You know, also hasn't led the league in touchdown passes and has led the league in interceptions? Josh Allen. Joe Burrow has also never led the league in touchdown passes either. Number three, Jackson is both a great passer and runner. But Jackson is a quarterback that passes first and runs second. Unlike what most people think. It's amazing how if he makes one mistake that all fans talk about him. But if Burrow, Allen, or even Mahomes make a mistake, or similar to Justin Herbert as well, it's not their fault. However, if Jackson makes a mistake, it's his fault and not his team, coaches, or even the refs. I still think this was a catch by Isaiah Likely, and this was a great drive by Lamar Jackson. Most quarterbacks could have not done this. Number four. For the years he has been healthy and played a majority of the season, he has made the playoffs every time. The former Heisman winner has also won the AFC North three times. That is very impressive since the AFC North is the toughest division in football. Now, you guys might think I'm a Josh Allen, Justin Herbert, or Joe Burrow hater. I am not. I am just stating the facts that Jackson is simply better and stats back it up. Number five, if Jackson couldn't throw, he would not be a starter. Jackson has been the NFL for six years now. If he could not throw, he wouldn't be in this league or he wouldn't be a starter and a backup. It's crazy why some fans think this, especially for the creator I'm making this video for. I hope he really watches it because he really needs to learn or really needs to watch football or just Lamar Jackson. Jackson is the best quarterback not named Mahomes because of what he can do. He also outplayed in Mahomes in week one, and the only reason why he lost was because of the refing was trash, and many fans, except for the Chiefs, would agree with me. Also, look at Jackson's stats. They're very impressive. Also, Jackson is one of seven quarterbacks to have a perfect passer rating multiple times. The list, which I'm talking about, includes Ben Roethlisberger, Tom Brady, Peyton Manning, Kurt Warner, and of course, Lamar Jackson. The quarterbacks that are not on this list are Patrick Mahomes, yes, Patrick Mahomes, Josh Allen, and Joe Burrow. Some other passing achievements include becoming the first quarterback in NFL history to pass for over 3,000 yards and rush for 1,000 yards in a single season, highlighting his rare dual threat ability. Jackson became the fastest quarterback in NFL history to reach 5,000 passing yards and 2,000 rushing yards in just 35 games. I'll repeat that, just 35 games. Lamar Jackson holds the record for the most passing touchdowns in Ravens franchise history, passing Joe Flacco. Some people think he could be a Hall of Famer. He's probably not, but some people think he is, and they always, they never question his passing ability. Against the Colts in 2021, Jackson threw for a career-high 442 passing yards and four scores. That's also a franchise record for a single-game performance. You know who hasn't thrown for that many yards? Josh Allen. The most yards he's thrown for a game was 424 yards. And also, Jackson is one of just two players in league history to become a unanimous MVP. The other name? You might have heard of him. Tom Brady. I just wanted to make this video to show why some fans who think he can't throw are very delusional. Let me know in the comments what you think, and also don't forget to like the video, and if you haven't, subscribe. I wanted to let you guys know about the creator who I'm making this video about is very delusional and not very smart, and plus just a really big hater. He is just a hater, as I simply said. Let me know in the comments what you think. Down and more! Taking it all the way into the end zone, Odell Beckham Jr.